What's going on everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. Folks, we're going to have a look at a high-rise photo from the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter. When you see this terrain, it's absolutely awesome. Now, somebody had mentioned the channel Olympus Sky, where he's actually done this, and I'm going to show you that real quickly. He's found some interesting things in there, but I'm going to go a step further because there's some crazy lines in this photo right next to one of the anomalies he mentions. Let's just jump right into it. Or you can see it right here in the Olympus Sky Channel. It says Mars, lots of structures and houses, squares. Now, he does a really good job of this and finds some really interesting stuff. Again, I'm just going to add to what he found. Folks, crazy. You guys tell me, what do you think this is nothing more just natural terrain or structures? My personal opinion, I believe they're absolutely structures. Let's just jump right into Photoshop. I'll show you. Okay, you can see I counterclockwise this by about 8 degrees, roughly. And the area we're going to look at is over here. This is really cool, folks. Now, right off the bat, I don't know if you guys can even see this, but this is cool because right here looks like some kind of weird cannon. You guys see that? Look at that. Now, that's what he mentions in this video, so I don't take credit for that. That's pretty cool. That is just awesome to me. What I did also notice was something more interesting. What I found interesting was this other piece down here. Notice this white piece and this nice, smooth contour. Okay, but then it stops like this. Looks like it goes like this. Another shop line. That, to me, right off the bat, is not natural. Okay? But what really started interest to me was these pieces down here. Look at all the little crazy lines and little pieces in here. Look at the little details. I'm going to zoom in here. This is pretty cool. Okay, here. Look at the other lines as well, like they were really trying to hide some of this. You can see some of the lines doing this, going out and around like this. There's one that's coming out like this. You guys see that? Folks, they're making this look like there is absolutely no height to this. It's almost a flat ground. But all of these little pieces in here, we're going to bring that out. Here's another section I think you'll find interesting. Just behind it, up here. Notice the straight lines here. Okay. You see something back here? Got what looks like something going like this. Also take note of this area right here, which looks like this weird opening in the ground. And almost looks like some kind of cave entrance, and you can just walk right into this thing. And of course we can't invent any of this, so it's always pure speculation, right? Um, this item I found pretty interesting. And you see, that's actually got a base to it, folks. You can see the line right there. See it right here. You'll see it a lot better in a moment. Now, just behind that to the left, check out these lines. Something going like this. Something coming around. All right, let's just get into the full enhancement and have a better look. Jump right in. Here's the cannon piece we were looking at. What looks like a cannon. Right? We have this piece down here. That, to me, right off the bat, is not natural. But then, folks, look at all the little pieces down here. Look at the way these are shaped. We have what looks like structures here. Almost looks like it's doing this and then back down. We have something that's doing this, going across, and it seems to be like something's going up and over it. Almost like a cross section. I'm going to zoom in a hair bit more and let you guys see that. Check that out. Nice corner right there. You can see here. And then it stops right here. You can see what they look like. They See how it goes like this and it goes back around and it comes like this? It looks like they try to put like a, a blurring over these areas. One does this, like a crisscross. Check that out right there. But you can clearly see that this thing does that. Okay. This looks like it's almost arched and almost looks like it has this square opening or it's because there's a side wall of this thing. Either way. Back out of here a bit. This I found very interesting. These lines here. All of these lines. Notice how these things run all in the same direction appears to have something doing like this. And we're seeing it like it's all one piece, but it's not, right? It has a lot of different sections. 
You can see that. Of course, I'm doing this a little sloppy, but you get the idea. Now, again, we can go back, folks, to the actual original, and we can have a look. It's right there. You can see that. Again, they're making the lines disappear and put like this whited haze or an overlay over this to hide the dock details. And that's the whole key to it, right? Okay. Let me just back up just a hair bit more. Here's what looks like that weird towel with a base right here. Look at the surrounding areas. Looks like it goes off in this direction here, but then it goes like this. And what looks like, honestly, it looks like a giant thumb sticking out, sticking right up in the air. See that? But again, notice the colors. These colors aren't because it's natural ground. The colors here are because of the manipulation. And because I'm going over these areas with a burn tool, guess what happens? You start seeing more and more of that. Notice if you go down here, and I haven't even done this area, but I can show you right here. Check that out. You can see... Okay, and you can see one piece, one right next to it. One almost looks like this pointed piece here. What are we seeing here, guys? Look at look at the pieces, and you can see just underneath this pointed piece right here. At least it looks pointed. Doing this, there's an actual shadow near it, but what they did, again, was take away the darker areas. Therefore, you won't be able to see many outlines. The shadows are pretty much gone. Everything's gone for a reason, because they want to get rid of what's in this photo. Back up just a hair bit more right here. I just think this is really awesome. This alone stuck out for me. In fact, I did a video on this a while back. I think it's right around the other person did his. Um, because what drew me to it was not only just that, but it was this. No way is that natural the way that looks. And when you see these other objects right next to it, it's not tiny because we can see this is a good sized swath area. Right? We can see that. And unfortunately, we don't have a scale to this, which a lot of people get frustrated because there are no scales. And they used to actually supply them, especially on some of these pans or panoramas that they would do for some of these rovers, right? And suddenly, they're not there anymore, folks. They're just not there. Like I said, this looks like a giant cannon right there in the circle. And then these are what look like structures, right? So instead of the colors messing with our eyes, let's get rid of that. Now we can see this. Now I'm going to dock it up so we can bring up more of the lines and just tone it down as far as brightness. Gives you a little bit more 3D effect, okay? What I'm seeing, no way is that natural. No way. In fact, I'm going to tilt this a little bit more, just like that. Check that out. What do you guys think of that? Again, look at all the little lines all the way. Up to the back here. There you go. Again, larger structures, another structure here, which remember we had said before where they built either inside or on the side of mountains or made a mountain or, or a butte into an actual structure. Who knows? It's pure speculation because we just don't know. However, it does not look like it's natural. If it is natural, that is really good. Mother Nature is awesome on Mars. Let's uh, put this whole screen. Folks, have a look. Pause it right here. Tell me what you think. I'm going to go to the color here and just do this. Have a look again. And again, the dark in black and white. And there you go, folks. Folks, I said this a hundred times. I mean, you can't help but to see, you know, structures or something that looked like structures at one point, right? As far as I'm concerned, every time I see something different, whether it's the moon, Mars, we just did one of Pluto, when you bring the lines back out, it tells a whole different story. It is nothing like natural as they claim. Not natural geology. It doesn't look anything like that. Now, does it have a surrounding area full of rocks, ice, whatever it may be? Absolutely. These are different planets and moons and other bodies, right? But when I see certain things like that, the way the shapes and the way they are, perfectly 90 degree corners, long straight lines, they're running parallel with each other. No, I don't believe mother nature is going to do that. But 
As always, you guys have the last say. Drop your comments down below and let me know what you think. Please like and share. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up so that YouTube will share it. Folks, I've got some cool ones coming up for you, so stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace, guys.